In honor of Women's History Month, a familiar face from Coral Gables has her life story featured at Women's Park. The exhibit is called A Retrospective on Roxy O'Neill Bolton, and it features the life and times of the prolific women's activists. Everything from photos, wardrobe, and family memorabilia were on display for guests in the Roxy O'Neill Bolton Women's History Gallery. Following the gallery viewing was a ceremony that honored Bolton and her extraordinary work in the South Florida community. Representatives from the Miami-Dade Parks and Recreation, Congresswoman Ileana Ross Layton's office, and former Mayor of Coral Gables Dorothy Thompson were some of the few that commended Bolton's character and accomplishments. I feel great. I'm 83, still standing, enjoying the friendships that I have. It's Women's History Month. and. I just want to say to every woman, make a difference if you can for another woman. Reach out, make a difference, make it better. An emotional Bolton thanked everyone for their support over the years and told some stories from her own struggles in life. Named the mother of Woman's Park, the 15-acre park was a dream of Bolton's for many years and will continue to honor all the women in Miami-Dade County who have contributed to better our community. This park will continue to evolve it sits in a very interesting, diverse neighborhood. We would like the park to also have an, uh, another aisle that will, a building to house a women's museum, which would be the third women's museum in the country. And we definitely want to remain significant to the neighborhood. And I believe we are accomplishing that. It, it will remain basically the same unless Sylvia and Sweat is able to get a archives. Uh, I, I don't know whether I'll be around then, but uh, I'll leave my football prints. The exhibit in the Roxy O'Neill Bolton Women's History Gallery, located at 10251 West Flagler Street, will be available for viewing until April 2nd. For What's Happening Coral Gables, David Alvarez.